Hey guys and welcome to Words of Scale. So there have been quite a few updates as far as LLMs go. There's been a new update to GPT-4 Turbo. Now a few days ago or a day ago Gemini 1.5 came out and then we have an exciting Command R Plus LLM and I thought this would be a good opportunity to test my one-click SEO prompt since we've been testing it extensively in the previous videos and we have some data to share. So we'll be choosing a keyword which is does agility writer pass a detection and then we'll measure the word counts, the SEO score, readability and the AI detection score. And thankfully, all these models are available inside of u.com. This is a subscription that I'm keeping for now. As you can see, there is a vast array of different models. And before we start, let me remind you that I have a helpful content mastery course, which is $97, but the value is insane. So you get a huge discount on my other course, which is a niche hunter course. You get free access to my premium AI detection ninja course. You get four free GPDs, including the outline genius, and you get a lifetime access to all the future updates and the course is only 97 bucks. I've just copied my prompt and so the first one will be the new and updated GPT-4 Turbo. Let's run this prompt. A few weeks ago u.com actually added this feature that you can now attach files thankfully. I have no idea why they didn't do this earlier but now when you use different models you have the ability to attach files which wasn't present before. So I can already see some internal links which is nice. A table, another internal link which is actually the same one. And a conclusion. So this is a different internal link, but still GPT-4 has a lower end word counts as per usual. So let's first go to NeuronWriter. This way we will see the SEO score and the word count as well. The SEO score is 72, which is almost the best SEO score. And the word count is unfortunately only 586. And I've just realized I had the wrong table, so this is the correct table. The SEO score is 72, the word count is 586. So the previous effort of GPT-4 Turbo inside of Perplexity gave us almost 440 words. Now let's check readability. And we have not prompted for a better readability, admittedly. And this is a high grade 14. And for AI detection, I'm using the 2.0. This is 0% original. Okay, let's now try Gemini 1.5. Let me attach the links.txt which is the file with my sitemap, basically. Okay, so I'm not seeing any internal links so far, and the output is extremely low um, as far as the word count. So this is very embarrassing, almost. Let's try this again. So I'm giving Gemini 1.5 another try, another opportunity to prove itself. Okay, still no internal links, unfortunately. And the output is somewhat longer, not by much. So let's check it out. The score to beat is 72. It is now 63. And actually, this is longer than GPT-4, but the SEO score is much lower. So 63 and 657 words. How about readability? Same grade 14, which means that you have to prompt separately for better readability. And in my helpful content mastery course, I'm showing you how. And whenever a new LLM like Gemini 1.5 appears, I'm always hopeful that it's going to pass originality, but that's not always the case. And I have not run, oh, Gemini 1.5 before. Okay, so this is 0% original. This is unfortunate. Last one is Command R, which is an LM by Cohere, a new company on the market. I'm actually curious to know what that's going to turn out like. So let's head back to you. Let's make sure we have something that's can fetch internal links from. Okay. Already this looks like the longest output, just judging by the length of the paragraphs. This is going to turn out huge. Oh my god. It just keeps going. I don't see any internal links, unfortunately, but... Wow. This is massive. For a one-click prompt, the output is massive. And it just keeps going. And it looks like it wants to keep going, so we just say go on. Wow. This is close to 2,000 words, I reckon. Did we get any internal links? Will we? Oh, internal links. Oh, interesting. So we didn't get any internal links. Huh. It looks like it wanted to place internal links. Huh, interesting. Oh, this needs more testing. Let's just see what the word count is on this. 75 and... Oh, 2... 2,500 words. 75 in SEO, so guys, this is... Huh. 
This needs further testing. This is the longest one-click output that I think I've ever gotten, with an, with an exception of my uh, sequence prompt. 2572. Wow. Now I'm very curious um, as far as readability. So it's 2000 to 2500 words, but the grade of readability is still 14, unfortunately. Okay. But still, we could have prompted for better readability. Let's check AI detection. Now I'm curious about AI detection. And if this passes 2.0, this is going to be my new favorite LLM, <laughs> at least for the time being. Ah, it was so close. Zero. Okay. So let's review. The longest output by far was that by the comment R LLM. The highest score, at least for the uh, tested three, but not uh, the highest score overall. I would say it's on par. And yeah, so this is interesting, guys. I will look into commands or command R plus further. If you want me to do more tests, let me know. Go check out the helpful Concept Mastery course. I love you guys, I appreciate you guys, and I'll see you next time. Cheers.